All right, it is officially time to head out to Shalan. It is about a three hour trip. Hopefully I'll get some cool clips along the way so I can bring you guys along with. Bronte just finished packing for us, thank God. I mean, I packed a little bit, but she's honestly way better at packing than me, so she usually takes over. I'm not complaining. <laughs> but yeah, let's head out and let's have a good time. So we just hopped on the road and immediately realized that we forgot to go get gas. <laughs> so this is already off to a rough start. But luckily, this car that we're in gets really, really good gas mileage. And it's saying that it has 190 miles left before we need to get gas. And we are roughly 165 miles out. So it's going to be somewhat close. So we're going to try and risk it and see how far or how close we can get. We'll see. We have officially arrived to our spot on Chelan. This is a pretty, pretty awesome view. Let's go check it out. I'm super stoked. This is gonna be an awesome week. But yeah, so this is the view right from our spot. This is pretty legit. Basically gonna be hanging out in the water all week. And it's like 90 degrees out, so it's perfect. And last year I was here, last, I guess two years ago, when I was here, uh, it was covered in smoke the entire time because it's in the middle of Washington. But it's looking great right now, so I'm pretty stoked about this. All right, so we just made some drinks and we're hanging out on the dock and life is good. I'm so, so happy that we finally made it and I'm finally on a vacation for the first time in basically a year. All right guys, it is the next morning and Bronte and I are on our way to head into town to... What are we doing? Some shopping stuff, look around, explore. Guess we're doing some shopping. And then we are gonna be hanging out all day on the lake. to go ring that bell. Do you think we can? We can try. Damn. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. There's a bell? It's, it's like duct tape together. And <laughs> that was uneventful. So it's a little after noon, and I've been trying to fight it this whole time, but I am so tired and exhausted. We were up until like three or four last night, and just hanging out, catching up with everyone. And I, Bronte, I need some caffeine. Like you need I, coffee? I, coffee, energy drinks, I don't care what it is, but I need some caffeine like ASAP. All right guys, got some life. <laughs> I needed this so bad. I didn't really end up getting too much, except Bronte got some new sunglasses that she's been wanting forever. The little heart-shaped ones, I don't know. They're cute. Um, anyways, so now it is time to go hop in the lake and I guess just kind of have a chill day. One, two, three. Our kids are in elementary school. Hello. We're in the water. 
Alright guys, so it is the end of the day and we've been hanging out in the lake all day and just kind of soaking it all up and it is starting to get towards sunset so I'll snag you guys a view it's actually one of the coolest things ever being here and so we are about to go out to dinner because it is actually Bronte's mom's birthday so we're going to go get some Mexican food and we're going out with our whole gang that we're with. Well, there's, there's like 15 people at least. So let's go do it. All right guys, so we are on our way right now to Mexican food and probably gonna get either a margarita or a mojito and a big burrito. Actually, we're here right now. I thought it was a little further down, but we're here. Last night was super, super fun just celebrating with Bronte's mom. And it is now the next morning, and we are about to head out on the water and we'll be kayaking for an hour or so, right? It's an inflatable kayak, so we'll see how that goes. So hopefully, it doesn't have a hole or something. That would be absolutely awful. But Bronte's gonna be bringing her along her little camera, so we'll go do that now, and hopefully, it works out. We have it inflated and set up. Bronte's doing all the work. Let's go do it. You guys, look. We're doing something outdoors. I'm not just a gamer that sits inside all day. We're crazy. We're going wild. <laughs> I'm lounging. <laughs> but Ryan's getting the moving his body a little bit. Oh yeah. All right, you guys. So we were swimming along, and we saw a shark. Have a real there's. A little buoy right here, and they seemed to like a shark. It's actually pretty cool. All right, it's time to head back. Let's do it. Bronte, send us home. <laughs> this isn't your gift. All right, Bronte, you got this. Yep. Get some nice big strokes. We're moving. Yep. All right. Do a couple on the right. There you go. Keep going. More on the right. Keep going until you're straightened out. Come on. Well, look at your oars. You have a. Okay. What did I do wrong? <laughs> I swear I just did it all right. <laughs> okay, looks like I'm actually I'm gonna have to paddle us back because Bronte doesn't doesn't have the capacity <laughs> to push us. <laughs> Alright guys, we made it back to dry land. Yes, and Bronte does not know how to paddle clearly. I don't know. You could have also been that you were in the front. They I don't were know. just they were just really bad oars. We'll blame it on that. All right, guys, that is going to wrap this vlog up. It is only about halfway through the vacation, so there is gonna be a part two uh, very, very shortly that will be going up on my channel. Stay tuned for that one, and we're gonna be doing some wine tasting in it, and we're gonna go out on a boat and kind of wrap up this vacation. Super, super excited for that, so please be sure to check out the next video in a couple of days that will be coming out. But that is going to do it for this vlog, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.